Tobias had gotten his first speaking role, simply by signing away the life rights of everyone he loved. And now he needed some research. I'm George Sr. Ooh, that's good. That's the voice. I've got the voice. <laughs> that's one. not my voice. Oh my god! What are you doing here? I'm having a f***ing tea party. What does it look like? I live here. You tell anybody you are dead. Tobias saw the raw power of George Sr. Stop licking my hand, you horse's ass. A power he needed the man to teach him. That's it. So he explained the project, and George Sr. agreed on one condition. If you play me, you gotta play me like a man and not some mincing little Polly or, 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 or Nelly. I get those names confused. Apologies. Apologies all around. And Lindsay was about to see a Tobias with the raw power of George Sr. I sort of want to talk to you about some things. It's a little late for talk, Lindsay. I'm a man of action now. You don't need the calories. This isn't working. Is it my imagination, or is he more commanding and, and mannish? It's like, I don't know, maybe I do want to be with him. Then you should go to him. For as it is written, you shall be with whom you have formed a more perfect union with under God. She's right. This isn't working.